Hey guys, Steve Good here with the Scroll Saw Workshop. I want to show you a little uh, tip that you can try if you do not have a drill press and uh, you need to drill your interior entry holes in some rather fine fretwork uh, patterns. Uh, it's very important that that hole be drilled uh, 90 degrees to the surface. Otherwise, you could end up with a situation like I have here. This is a piece where obviously I was going to cut the exterior of this circle out and I had some you, know, you can see not really that fine a fretwork. It could be a lot tighter than this even. But because the interior hole that I drilled right here was drilled at an angle, I had blowout on this side. So the drill bit came in and actually came out the side of the, of the piece. You wouldn't have seen that because you hadn't cut the exterior of the piece before you started. Uh, so if you, you know, had already done a lot of cuts, and you happen to get to this piece and you notice you'd blown out. There's really no easy way to fix that. So if you have a drill press, that's not a problem because you just simply come in with your drill press and you get a 90 degree uh, drill every time. But if you have to use a hand drill and you're trying to do some fairly intricate uh, drilling right here to make sure it's straight, sometimes that can be a little uh, tougher than it seems. So I want to show you a little trick. Okay, I've got my drill here, and what you see that I've made here, now I printed this out on my 3D printer, but you could also make one of these, uh, if you had temporary access to a drill press, uh, you could make one of these pretty easy. Just cut yourself out a one inch uh, diameter hole that's about a half an inch thick, and then drill a square uh, 1 16th inch hole in the center of it, just so that your 1 16th inch drill bit fits on that uh, guide right there. But now what you can see we can do with this guide is we can take our drill and we can put it on the interior hole that we need to be straight right there. Once we get it there we can slide our uh, guide down and now we have a guide to make sure that we're drilling accurately straight up and down into that piece. So now when we pull that up and we look at our hole, we know it's going to be 90 degrees to the surface of the piece. Now, of course, if you're out here where it's not that important, you can just drill your hole by hand. But if you, every time you get into the smaller fretwork where you want to be careful, just go ahead and, you know, leave your guide on there, come back to it, lower the guide down, make sure you hold it pretty tight, and then drill your hole. Uh, now, again, I printed this out on the 3D printer uh, just because it was easy for me and I kind of like playing with the printer anyway. Uh, but if you cut one of these out and then could have access to uh, somebody's drill press just for a few minutes, just long enough to drill your hole, uh, you know, and then make sure once you get it drilled that it's a fairly tight. It doesn't have to be perfectly tight. You want it to move a little bit, but you want it to be a pretty good fit so you know you've got an accurate uh hole once you get done drilling it. So anyway, just a little tip there for you to try. I'm Steve Good. Thanks for being here with me at the Scroll Saw Workshop.